Action News, Delaware Valley's leading news program with Gary Papa, Dave Roberts, and Jim Gardner. Time for Health Check Now. For decades, chelation therapy has been a popular alternative treatment for heart disease, but some physicians say it's worthless. Now, a government-sponsored trial is underway to get some answers. Anita Brickman says local residents can take part in it. For Bill Schemmer of Ewing Township, New Jersey, the first sign of heart disease came at the age of 39. I thought it was just, you know, indigestion coming on. But then the pressure started coming up and I went to the hospital and it was a good sized heart attack. Bill recovered. He watched his diet, exercised regularly, and hoped he was out of the woods. But when he was 45... It didn't really feel like a heart attack at the time, but I just had this weird feeling. I went to the hospital and it turned out it was a heart attack. After the second attack, Bill had bypass surgery, and then, getting his cardiologist okay, he enrolled in TACT, the trial to assess chelation therapy. During chelation, a compound called EDTA, a commonly used food preservative, is put in the body through an IV drip. Supporters, such as Dr. Allen Magaziner, say it removes harmful metals that can contribute to heart disease. It also has a strong antioxidant effect. And he says it may keep blood flowing more smoothly by improving platelet cells. The platelets and the red cells become less sticky and less clumpy. Julio Gonzalez is a believer. This 82-year-old underwent chelation after a heart attack seven years ago. After the third treatment, I noticed that uh, I wasn't huffing and puffing coming up the stairs. Earlier this spring, he passed a checkup with flying colors and had a ball on a golfing vacation. We played golf every day for eight straight days. And uh, it's fine. The chelation treatments in the trial won't replace standard heart care, but will be in addition to it. Doctors are hoping to get more people involved so the government doesn't cancel the study. I'm Anita Brickman, Channel 6 Action News. And for information on these trials, call the Magaziner Center. It's 856-424-8222. Or as always, check the news links and recalls section of our website, WPBI.com.